I guess there are no cops. No in my own life, though. Or I got it. Where is the other passenger? Ah, it's right here. He was behind all the time. Okay. So we're gonna get this loan. I lost control for a second. Well, that's no idea, right? Oops! Didn't realize fucking radar. Pay attention to the conversation, not to the radar. Can't fucking walk and chew gum at the same time. Oh, another complaint because of my driving. Kind of surprising I don't see that in the comments. Hey, that wasn't my fault, by the way. Sorry, girls. You girls are disposable. Big dicks are not. All right, cuts in. Hi, fellas. We're here to see Bruno. Hiya, Henry. Hmm. If you got guns on you, put them down there. So they know him. Okay. Them glasses. Hiya, Bruno. Hello, Henry. Uh. So, to what do I owe the pleasure of your company today? I need 35 grand in $20 bills. Oh, that's a lot of money, Henry. A lot of money. Tell me. Why should I give that much to a small-time guy like you? Huh? To buy stuff and things. Convince me. I got a sure thing. You'll have 45 by the end of the week. What kind of sure thing? Sorry, Bruno. That's a trade secret. Then 45 is not enough. I'd be more comfortable with 65. That's a bit steep, even for you. 50 is all I can do. Henry, Henry, I have no guarantee I'll get my money back. And you have nowhere else to go. So, how about 60? Don't think of it as interest. It's more like my cut of the profits. 55, final offer. Anything more than that, it's not worth my time. Deal. I'll give you $35,000 today, and you'll give me $55,000 by Friday. If you don't pay it back by then, the debt goes up by 10000 every week. You'll get it by Friday. Okay. Isaac, prepare $35,000 in $20 bills. Now, you know I trust you, Henry, but if you screw me... Remember these wise words from the Bible. Oh no, Jesus. My wrath shall wax hot, and I will kill you with the sword, and your wives shall be widows, and your children fatherless. Exodus, chapter 22, verse 24. <laughs> I'm impressed. You don't seem like the church-going type. Uh, but just remember, the money isn't mine. So even if you get rid of me, that doesn't get rid of your debt. So no funny business, okay, boys? Sure, Bruno. Thank you, Isaac. You want to count it, Henry? I'll take your word for it, and I'll bring it back. Yeah, I'm way too lazy to count it. Cut. So close that I shit. So. <laughs> Good luck, boys. Yeah, that wasn't too hard. But, yeah. I would be a little scared. So, what are we doing now? Drive to see to the Sea Gift Warehouse. To complete the deal, basically. Alright, that's where we're going. That's not our car. Oh, that's the one. Sorry. 
have an awful memory for the cars I was last driving. I have been changing so many times. So, oh, there is a dialogue. How come you know the Bible so good, Henry? You read it or something? Uno always uses the same quote. I go to church on Sunday, so I ask the police one time. You go to church? Yeah, and I can understand why you don't. They use big words. There's no hookers in the fool's mouth. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Which I ain't been there since 45. What? That time your mother made you go to confession? Yeah, that time she smacked me for checking out some chick's school. <laughs> Joe, how long's it been? Easter. Ah, oh, that ain't too bad. 1941. I take that back then. You're going straight to hell. <laughs> what? You're just figuring that out now? Don't worry. I'll save seats for the both of you. Yeah, that's what I was you thinking. They sure think they're going to go to heaven. Must be the same guy. Yeah? Who'd you hear? Well, you know Mickey the Crab, right? What? The guy who cleans the bathrooms at Carlos Joint? Yeah, the guy who's only got a finger and a thumb on his left hand. Guess how that happened. Ah. Huh. So that's the type of punishment he applies when they don't pay their debts. Yeah, I'm getting it too. Yeah, probably you're gonna get your penis cut off instead. That would be a tragedy. What red light? I've heard that complain quite a few times already, but most of the time I simply don't see the red light. Just like in real life. Except that I don't drive. I mean, I do know how to drive, but I don't have a license anymore. Because it expired, and I'm too lazy to renew it. True story. You know what else is true story? Me being gay. Well, sorry. Follows the Chinese guy in before. Everybody in here are Chinese. Or Asian looking. Or Ching. Okay. No. Don't use those words. Let me do all the talking. Yeah. Now let's ask Joe to do the talking, right? Hey, we got some business with your boss. Greetings, Mr. Tomasino. Yeah, hello, first. Hey, you piece of shit. So, <laughs> take me to your boss. Or to your leader, or whatever references that's supposed to be. Because it's a funny joke. Funny internet jokes that everybody understands by me. Which makes me very proud, by the way. But I still make those those references regardless. Okay, what about shutting the fuck up like forever? And I can go faster, but I guess I have to follow Mr. China. Calling me Mr. China was racist? What do you think? Tell me in the comments. Come, Henry. Hello, Mr. Wang. Let us well, Henry knows business. everybody. Is your suitcase heavy enough? See for yourself. Wow, they come very fast. Take it away and bring the goods. You're a good man, Henry. Here is your merchandise. Each bag contains one kilo. Each kilo weighs a little more than two pounds. Which one do you want to test? Seriously, I would be super nervous in such situation, but Henry doesn't give a fuck. Everything is under control for him. He knows his shit. Okay, we're good. I'm glad. Next time, we can give you twice the amount. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Wong. The pleasure was all mine. Get off. <laughs> See how easy that was. Get back in the car. Okay, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching, guys. See you next week.